this, I'm not tall enough for this. Whatever, I'm just going with it. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I have a super exciting video this week that I'm super excited about, obviously. Um, before I get started though, if you don't know whom I am, whom I am, my name is Sarah. I've had type 1 diabetes for over 20 years and this channel is just about my life with diabetes and being a crazy person because that's who I am deep down inside. Yesterday, the um, tandem, the tandem, released their limited app update, launch, pump update, whatever you want to call it for being able to bolus from your smartphone, which is crazy and so exciting. And this is great because I don't have to, I mean, I still have to wear my pump, but I can just like put it in my pocket and just like forget about it, sort of. I mean, you can't forget about it, but I don't have to pull it out every time to like take insulin. Insane. I thought I would use this video to show you around the app. I just, wow, I almost threw my phone to my face. I just updated it very late last night at like 10 o'clock and I went to bed at like 10 o'clock. And I went to bed, did the training and, and just, I have it and I've been using it for today. So I thought I would do a little tour of what I can tour you with right now. And even though I haven't even been using it for that long, I just thought like, hey, why not? So, so before I start, one, I have my phone on do not disturb. So I'm really hoping that like no notifications come through and I'm going to try to like screen record this and talk at the same time and put the screen record like here. Actually, maybe I should like move over a little bit so I can put it here and I'm going to really make sure that it's like synced up. It might not be so <laughs> wish me luck. Okay. Um, so again, as I said before, Tandem is in their limited launch. I was able to sign up for that. I saw a like uh, Instagram post that said, hey, limited time of it, like only, and this was back in June, if you want to sign up to get, see if you can get in the limited launch, like sign up here, put your pump serial code in, blah, blah, blah. So I did that and I got accepted. So this is not like anything special to me specifically. I know a bunch of other people on Instagram have it, quote, influencer influencer or quote not influencer I hate that word yeah and then yesterday so i did that and they were like okay we'll like let you know whatever blah 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 yesterday i got a message from someone that was like did you see the update and i was like what are you talking about and she was like the app update is here like you can update it and you know like fill out your you can bullets from your phone and i was like oh my god so i went updated the app and nothing looked different and i was like did I miss something? I was like, was I supposed to turn something on? I was like, I don't know. So I was like, whatever. And then later, someone else was messaging me or it might've been the same person, honestly, I don't know. They were like, no, you have to go through the training online on the portal. So you have to do the training on the tandem portal, which if you have a tandem, you should have it like hooked up to the portal. It took me like an hour. I did the training last night, updated the pump, which I was so excited to like do this and hadn't thought about filming anything for this yet. So I didn't film any of that, but it was very easy process. The little like quiz thing was super easy. And then once you complete that, you get a download code or update code that you put in your pump and voila, it is updated. That's how I got this like cool update. Um, again, I don't know when they're fully releasing it, but hopefully soon. They said over the summer, it's July, it's July 13th today, so. Also, don't judge my blood sugar. I just ate lunch and I'm, again, as I always am trying to film this before the sun comes streaming into my apartment in the afternoon. And if you can hear that little thing flying on the table, it's my pump. So without further ado, let's look at the app. And again, I'm gonna try and sync this so it looks good. Wish me luck. Okay, so here it is. I'm hoping I'm all synced up. Here it is, you can see in the top uh, my, I think the same for you. Oh, my blood sugar just changed to 146. You can see where your blood sugar is in the top left-hand corner. You can see how much insulin on board. Again, I just ate lunch, so. I just changed my pump last night, so I have 225 units on board, and you can see that, I can't remember what the blue means. Oh, the blue just means that I'm getting my normal basal rate, which is 1.25. Time and range I turned on just because I kind of like to see like how much I'm in range and how much I'm not, but that's what the green stuff is. And I learned the, <laughs> Green numbers where it says all across my graph, like all of that is like every time I looked to see if I should take insulin, which I was like messing around with this earlier. So there's a lot of those on it. And to be honest, I don't totally know the difference between the solid border circle 
and like the two 125s. I can't remember. Actually, let me test something really quick while we're doing this. Okay, 146. Let's see. Okay, I got it. So the solid circle is when I've looked at it on my pump and the one with the like squiggly border is when I've looked at it on my phone. So anyway, if you look at the bottom of the screen here and I should make sure I'm over to the side, there is dashboard, bolus, notifications and settings. So bolus is the new exciting thing here. When you click on that, this lovely screen comes up and your blood sugar should be like auto populated in there. You can go in here and say like, oh, actually I'm like 300, but hold on, let's put 146 in there because that's what I actually am. You can also see that, I need to make sure I'm breathing. This is, this is a lot. <laughs> I'm very excited about this, so I'm having trouble breathing because I get really chatty when I'm really excited. You can tap the carbs and put in carbs. So let's say I'm gonna eat 40 carbs hit done and then it says I'm going to take 8.8 units, 8.89 units. You can see the food is 8.89. It's giving me like a little correction, I think. I don't know. Sometimes this confuses me, um, but it, you can also see my insulin on board and it does all the calculations, blah, blah, blah. It'll also say that due to the IOB on board, you um, might go low. So again, I'm going to I'm actually going to put like five carbs in there and take a much lower number because I'm going to like put this through, but I'm not going to take insulin. But just in case something happens, I want to put a much lower amount in. Um, but basically, you can also, if you want, tap the correction up at the top where it says units. Right now it says 1.1 units and I could put in like, well, I want to take 5.46 units or something. But let's go back to 1.11. Hit done. Then you hit the next button and it'll say like, if you have a adjustment, whatever. It basically says the same thing that the pump would say. Hit confirm, tap the deliver bolus button that is like throbbing, if you will, in the bottom. Hit that, it'll look at my face. And then right now, first of all, you just heard my pump go off. It says it's confirmed. I'm gonna hit the X because I don't wanna take that mm -hmm. insulin. You can just hear and you can see on my screen that it says stopped. Obviously zero units were delivered because this was just for demonstration purposes only. So I'm gonna hit okay. But basically when you take insulin, you unlock it with your face or your passcode. That is like a safety thing. Yeah, so that's, <laughs> that's a very quick tour of the pump. I'm trying to think real last minute if there's anything else in here to say about like the actual pump. It's very like, I don't know if the limited launch is because it's not 100% ready yet because I do have some things to say um, after this, but that's basically how you bolus from this app, which is so cool. I don't have to take my pump out anymore. It's amazing. I really hope this was timed right. Um, but the pump looks basically the same. The only thing that's different, and it won't look totally different now because I didn't take a complete bolus, but I'm gonna try and see make sure you can see that oh i hope you can there's a little blue dot right there there's like a little line here and there's a blue dot those are the times that you took insulin from your phone versus your pump that's the only thing that looks different on the actual pump and again you could hear that it like confirmed and went to my pump and blah 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 did all that fun stuff the only thing which again, this is why I'm not sure if this is like the soft launch, if you will. I keep wanting to call it the soft launch instead of the limited launch. But you still have to dismiss the alerts from your pump on your pump. So like if your blood sugar is high, like I'm sure mine is going to be in a little bit because as you probably just saw, I was going up because again, I just ate lunch. But you still have to dismiss the alerts on your pump. I think if not, your pump will just be like, you're high. Um, which I was kind of hoping wouldn't be the case because sometimes my pump is going off and you know I'm low or I'm high and I'm like I know and I've dismissed the alerts from my phone on my Dexcom app but I haven't like gotten it out of my pocket or looked at it on my pump because to be honest I don't know why but I was thinking it would have been super great or it would be really nice if you could dismiss the notifications from your app on your phone. The other thing is really right now I mean what you should basically say is you can only bolus from the app. You can't do anything with exercise mode, like turn it on or turn it off, which I'm hoping that's coming in the future. I'm honestly, I'm just so glad that this is like out period to be able to just bolus. Like 
if that stuff all comes later, that's no worries to me. And that is still super exciting. That's basically the app and the ability to bolus. It's very exciting. If you're a tandem user and you want to get this, definitely make sure you are up to date on all your training in the tandem portal. And I think, I don't know when this is actually coming out. I'll probably do another video when this is like actually, actually out. But because I know like I had another friend who's on the tandem who was like texting me about this last night and he was like, I don't see it. And I was like, I don't know who has it and who doesn't. But when I logged into my portal last night, Wednesday the 12th, it was there and I was able to update. So if you're able to update, that's super exciting. And if not, then I would say just wait patiently until it's actually available. And I don't know how they picked who to do it and what, but you definitely have to, I think they have a thing on their website. And if they do, I will link it below where you can check your pump software, check, make sure it's updatable and all that stuff. Um, I obviously just got my pump in April. I could not remember when I got it for a second. I just got my pump in April. So it's like brand new, fresh, has all the updates, is in the warranty. You also, I think, have to be in the warranty of your pump. I don't know. Very cool. This is the first time I've updated my pump ever on my own. When I was on Tandem before I got off of it, before they updated to the Control IQ, so I never like went through the update process. But it was super easy, super simple. And I just can't believe that I'm able to bolus from my phone. So crazy, so exciting. Who knows what they'll come up with in the future. And I'll definitely, now that this is even more like DIY loop when I was back on the loop forever ago, there's a video all on that. You'll have to go watch it. I'll link it maybe here or in the comments below. But I'll definitely have to do a like comparison because it's pretty much comparable now. I don't know what I was trying to say, but before I could take insulin from my phone with a DIY loop and now I can take insulin from my phone with the pump. And yeah, I don't know. I'm really rambling because I'm just really, I'm just really stoked. So the other thing I want to say really quick, and I'll put a little screen grab right here that I did this before is if you are um, taking insulin and it says you need a correction bolus, it will add a little square like you can see hopefully in the middle of the screen here that says like, would you like to add a correction bolus? Your glucose is above the target range of 110. So like, yes, you can tap yes or no. That is it for this video. This is very last minute. I was not expecting to record this today. I wasn't even expecting this update to come out like I didn't know when it would come out I knew it was gonna come out this month sometime I always look out here when I'm talking I'm really sorry I should make sure I look like at you guys but I wasn't expecting the update to come out so I'm super excited I'm excited to see what they do in the future and yeah if you have tandem let me know if you're planning to update your pump let me know if you're excited about this I think that's it for this video don't forget to like and subscribe follow me on Instagram turn on your notification bell all that stuff I upload every Friday at 3 p.m. Eastern Time, 12 p.m. Pacific. So that is everything. I'm gonna go take insulin from my phone now because I can do that. Yeah. So exciting. All right. See you guys in my next video. Goodbye.